Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, first off, I'll just make this simple. I'm going to start off and answer a few uh, questions that I've had. Um, somebody asked why I took such a long time off. Um, and if I was injured. No, I wasn't injured. Um, just had a hard time actually getting people to commit to fights. Um, if they did commit, then something ended up happening. Either the show, show canceled or is the guy backed out for whatever reason. Um, and I'm just kind of, I feel like I'm in that rough stage with my record. So people don't really want to fight me because I'm a lot better than my record. So I think that's, I think that's what the issue is. Uh, somebody else also asked me where I train or who do I train with. I'm not sure if you're asking specifically the gym or the personnel, so I'm just going to kind of answer both. Um, I train at SSF Submission Academy in Clarksville, Tennessee. Uh, Mike Merriman is my head MMA trainer. Uh, Jason Martin does a lot of our jiu-jitsu classes, um, gi and no gi. <clears throat> uh, Kenneth. He does our strength and conditioning classes, um, and as far as actual tra uh, training partners, I mean, we have anywhere from 30 to 40 amateurs and about 10 pros, um, just to name a few, Nate Landweir, Chris Coggins, Adrian Thomas, um, those are those are three of my main training partners. Uh, I don't want to forget anybody out, or forget anybody, so sorry guys, but... That's that's a big list to try to remember all the names. I was asked about my opponent on the nineteenth. Uh, he has a couple submission wins, and they and I was asked if I could keep it on my feet. Um, I can, if I want to. Um, I can. I'll keep the fight wherever I want. Um, wherever it ends up doesn't matter either. Uh, he may have a couple submission wins, but. I don't know who these guys are, if they even have any kind of uh, jujitsu backgrounds to uh, defend his submissions, um, or if it was just a simple mistake. So who knows? Um, but yeah, as far as as far as keeping the fight standing, I don't care. I can keep it standing if I want to, but if I go to the ground, I'm comfortable too. So I just got done training. Um, we did strength and conditioning and we worked some no-gi jiu-jitsu. Um, been working a lot with the MMA gloves on, of course, because I got the fight coming up. And if you don't know or haven't trained um, with MMA gloves on and off, uh, it's a little bit different. Your grips are a little bit different. Um, some things that you can do or can hold on to with the gloves, you can't with, you know, without them and vice versa, of course. So, yeah, using using the gloves quite a bit. Um, just got done with dinner as well. Uh, it's short time. I'm less than two weeks out, so I'm really watching my diet. Uh, just had a little vegetable medley with some just uh, extra virgin olive oil, a little bit. Um, some grilled chicken. Uh, no sodium or anything on either. Um, and then just a little side of grapes, just to give me a little bit of something sweet. Um, <clears throat> other than that, about to hit the bed and prepare for another long day tomorrow. Thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate appreciate everybody's support, um, teammates, sponsors, um, everybody. I appreciate all you guys. Thank you.